guys, welcome back to Lindy Lou Productions. I do have some pretty exciting news to share with you guys. If you've been following me on my Instagram, which is right here, then you will know uh, that I did have this surprise coming. Um, I did also mention it, I think, in a couple of my last videos as well. Um, but I did happen to get a job on the weekends working for a trainer. Um, I'm just taking care of her horses, cleaning her stalls, and stuff like that in exchange for lessons and training and potentially leasing on one or two of her horses. So it is kind of like a working student type of situation. Um, but yeah, so I'm super excited because she's going to give me lessons on Lindy and Kip and then lessons on my lease horses at the other barn. Um, and then I can either use, you know, what I work for as a lesson or as like a lease, half lease type of thing on one of her horses. So I really can kind of pick and choose what I want to do each week. Like I can do whatever I want that week, which is really cool. And today, actually, she's having a clinic. She has a dressage trainer that, that works here. And then she's kind of more of a hunter jumper. She does both, but I think she kind of mainly focuses, at least for herself, more on hunter jumper. And they are having a dressage clinic today, a hunter jumper clinic tomorrow. I am in the dressage clinic today on one of her horses. And it is obviously Halloween based, so everybody will be dressed up. I, however, will not just because I didn't really know what to dress up as. So um, yeah, I'll enjoy watching everybody else dressed up, but I personally will not be. Um, but yeah, so hopefully I can get my GoPro on. Either way, hopefully I get some footage. But I'm just super excited about this opportunity because I think it's really going to be fun and I'm going to learn a lot and be able to grow a little bit more as a rider and not feel so stuck like I've felt lately. So I just really hope it works out and I'm excited to share it with you guys. But I will go around and introduce you to the horses really quick. So this is a little Halflinger Gelding Tony for Lesson horses. I just fed them and came their stall. He's super cute. And then this is an off-the-track thoroughbred that she has um, that did really, really cut his leg um, just like a week ago. So he's on stall rest um, and has his leg wrapped because he split off his tendon, basically, which is crazy. This is a Clydesdale Cross mare of some kind. Um, she is who I will be riding in the clinic today. I think she just kind of has her in for training um, to resell, like a resale project. That gelding is a sale project. He's actually already sold. I think probably will be leaving soon. Hey guys, I kind of have a bummer alert. Um, I did not get any footage of me riding today whatsoever. What ended up happening was like the group of riders before when I was supposed to go were really, they kind of ran way over. And so then we were way off. I kind of waited because I wasn't sure like, which horse I was riding, what saddle, da da da, because I'm new there. So I ended up having to be like in a huge rush to get down to the arena. And did not have time to take my camera, take my phone, put my GoPro on, nothing. So I'm super bummed because the horse I rode was a green beanie. Um, she was super green, but super sweet. And so I have not ridden English in legit probably four or five years consistently, at least. And my muscles are feeling it. I was afraid I was literally not going to be able to get off this horse and like catch myself on the ground because my muscles and my legs were just dead. And then I will be having a lesson with that instructor um, this coming week, which I then hope to be able to record, even if I have to ask her to take my camera and record some for me. Um, but that is the plan. So I'm sorry I didn't get any video. I'm like super bummed about that. But I just wanted to share with you guys my good news and my exciting news, which was that I got a working student position. So there will be lots more riding videos, hopefully crossing my fingers. Um, I'm really gonna try hard to make that happen. The only reason it didn't today, like I said, was because it was just like mass chaos, huge rush and I didn't even have time to hardly do anything. I didn't even grab my water, so I was like dying of thirst as I was riding. Um, but anyway, so yeah, that's kind of the plan there is to ride more, have more riding videos, and just gain more experience and confidence. Those are the two things that I want 
you kind of get stuck in a rut whenever you own the same horse for nine years, um, who I trust and I feel very confident and comfortable with. And so then whenever I would get on a horse I don't know, all of that would go down the drain. And so that's what I'm trying to fix because I just feel like you become a better, well-rounded rider when you ride other horses. Anyway, so yeah, we are probably going to be going to my lease horse barn um, Thursday morning for my first lesson. So stay tuned for that video. That probably will be my, my next video. I may do a barn vlog with Lindy um, in the next couple days, if not even potentially tomorrow because it's supposed to be beautiful outside. Anyway. I will see you guys later, and I thank you for watching. Bye!